The majority of new businesses in Queensland are based in the state's southeast, but that could be about to change. Queensland's chief entrepreneur is on a regional tour to promote startup culture outside major cities and encourage budding entrepreneurs to tackle high unemployment in the country. Simon Price knows how hard you have to work to start a small business. That's it, team. Great work. Nice and strong. The Rockhampton gym owner says it can be extra tough in a regional area. Sometimes when you're stuck in your own little bubble, you feel like you're really on your own and isolated and not sure you're going to get through those challenges. The state's chief entrepreneur, Mark Sowerby, is visiting his gym. He's in town to offer tips and advice to regional business owners. People out here are more resilient. They have to work harder to find a way through. That's a really important test for entrepreneurship. He's brought five other successful entrepreneurs on his tour of 11 regional towns, areas with high unemployment rates and few new businesses opening. The team's hoping to set up mentoring networks and inspire people to launch startups. We need jobs that comes from small businesses getting bigger or startups getting to the small business stage. That's where the jobs growth comes from. The Queensland government wants 20% of jobs to come from the digital startup sector within 15 years. Currently, there's only about 240 tech startups in Queensland, with more than 75% of those based in the southeast. Economics professor John Rolfe says the state needs to do more to facilitate growth in the sector. We're not getting the businesses in, say, IT or, or, or new medical um, research or, or those sort of things that are, that are really entrepreneurial and, and technology-based. There's more plans for lifting the startup game with further regional tours this year. Isabella Higgins, ABC News, Rockhampton.